Uh, there's no cable TV in town. Uh, lucky to have phones. It's a place with dirt roads, no street lights or sidewalks, no internet access, and the only store in the whole town is Will's Place. We have one store, not a supermarket, a convenience store, very small one. And, uh, but you know, it's just nice. It's quiet, uh, it's green, uh, it's friendly. Everybody knows everybody. Uh, it's a nice place to live. It's the kind of place where you'll find handmade windmills for sale and can get fresh eggs straight from the chicken coop. And it's in this little town of Unity, New Hampshire, approximately 60 miles west of Manchester, where Hillary Clinton and Barack Obama will hold their first public appearance together. First question was, why Unity? Here? Oh my God, you gotta be kidding me. Why here? It's a fair question. Why would two political powerhouses decide to hold their big event in a city with a population of only 1,600 people? Well, if the name Unity isn't a big enough hint, the voters in this town gave the two senators exactly the same number of votes in the January primaries, 107 votes each. Now the small community is gearing up for an event like this town's never seen. Friday's event promises to be big, so big that a crowd nearly double the population will descend upon this tiny little town. But with signs welcoming the political duo, it seems that the small community doesn't seem to mind the attention at all. I think it's great for our town. Puts us on the map. Usually uh, people don't know where Unity is. I've met a lot of people who go, you live where? It's kind of exciting, I think, yeah. Why? Uh, they have such a known two known people coming to this town. It's wonderful. And they plan on adding a few personal touches of their own to the event. We're going to have hamburgers and hot dogs down there so that some of the people can get fed. A little small town hospitality for those big city politicians. In Unity, New Hampshire, Bonnie Ghosh, The Associated Press.